Yeah. Your day is coming. Thank you, man. And uh, I, I'm glad to be a part of it. And uh, I'm glad to say that I was the one who uh, predicted the first. <laughs> <laughs> It had the victory last year. I took the feedback and the critiques on what I needed to do to my physique. And I just went back to the drawing board and I went back to the gym and I, I trained hard all year. I worked with my coach, Hani Grandpa. This is our third year working together. And he and I, our relationship in terms of coach athlete and also our personal relationship has grown tremendously. But at the end of the day, you have to have passion and love for this. You gotta wanna be in the gym. You gotta, you gotta love this. So I live it every single day and I just want to be the best, absolute best version of myself. So regardless of who I'm standing next to, I'm only focused on me and the opportunity that I have to compete on this stage is a window of time in my life and I want to make the absolute most of it. Here at the Mr. Olympia. I won the 212 a couple years ago. Now I'm in the open and I want to be the first two division Olympia champion and the number 18 Mr. Olympia. So yeah, there absolutely is good camaraderie. Um, I respect the champion, Hadi Chupin. You know, he, he's a phenomenal bodybuilder, great champion, well respected around the world, especially in this country. And uh, he's bringing the best out of all of us amongst the rest of the competitors. So it's also what I love too is instead of looking at the competition as this, I look at it as more or less your competition is holding you accountable for you to be your best. So if you're if you're you know wanting to slack one day, you're not wanting to go to the gym, then you think about your competition, well they're gonna go to the gym, they're gonna do it, they're Olympians, they're the best in the world. So it, it gives you that extra point to get up and, and do the work.
I, I don't take this for granted whatsoever. And whether that mean this opportunity, I don't want to take it for granted. Yeah. And also, I, I just want to remain grateful too, as I said earlier, because you have to, man. Like Ain't nothing wrong with being humble. Yeah. <laughs> so I just I feel blessed. I'm thankful, and uh, and yeah. this as an opportunity to build your character and and become stronger from within and uh, you know and and do your very best to enjoy the process maybe you're not the type of person that wants to throw in the towel maybe you're the type of person that really embraces this struggle and challenge so then you know I encourage you to to really try to be as present as you possibly can that's something else that I pray every day is Lord you know um, I pray that I can be more joyful in every present moment under all circumstances. And if you can do that, there's a lot that bodybuilding can really do for your life. It can radically change who you are for the better.